Hey, what's going on guys? It's Fallen Angel 14 and welcome back to a brand new video and as you could tell from the title already This is the level request series now of course before we actually get into the actual video I want to give you guys a little bit of an explanation of how this blah, of how this series is gonna work We're gonna start off with three levels I know I said five in the starter video well the announcement video But I decided to change it up since I have a, a plan of how I'm gonna do this series So I'm gonna do three levels each one is gonna have one footage one piece of footage as a gameplay part you know just me going through the level in one attempt and then the second part of footage is gonna go through the level in practice mode and I'm gonna do some commentary over the footage and describe what I like and I dislike about the level you know give my pros and cons about it and then at the ending of the levels I'm gonna give an overall rating and of course what do you call it <laughs> I didn't think this through for the first recording when I when I recorded this one so this one's not gonna do the best since this is the first episode but the second episode I have much more planned and if you guys are interested in this level request series and want me to commentate on your levels be sure to leave your ID below level ID below in the comments section and I'll get to it as much as I can and if you guys don't make it for the second episode it will definitely make it in the third episode but with that being said, that's all I have to say for the level request series. And one more thing I want to mention is my social media. I usually use Discord a lot and I use Instagram a lot. Discord, you guys could, what do you call it, you know, join the Fallen server. And from there on, you guys could chat with me, communicate with other members. It's not that active right now because, you know, it's just, just yeah, there. But what do you call it? Yeah, you guys could talk to me. You guys could, like, voice chat with me. I don't mind. Uh, you guys could text me, like I said. And uh, overall, though, it's like not that bad of a place you know has some rules obviously just follow them don't be toxic and we're all good here and for Instagram I use Instagram a lot and like I tend to post there okay a lot so if you guys want to follow up on what my life is like go ahead and follow me on Instagram I only have one account X fallen angel 14 X and if there's anybody else out there I highly doubt it though uh, that's not me okay so um overall though with that being said let's get right into the video and I hope you guys enjoy this Alright guys, uh, well I've been playing this level for quite some time and uh, it's kind of frustrating because this level is enjoyable but there's a lot of bugs. Like, a lot of bugs. I've been trying to play through this but I can't get past the ship segment. It's like a chance at making through. So I'm just not going to play this level. I'm just going to do it in practice mode and kind of just show you guys what it's all about. So, right here it starts off... Okay, obviously that part's... Uh, it can throw you off a little bit. Now, one problem I have are those fake orbs. Considering that, like, those are the only ones you'll have throughout this level. Everything else is fine right there, you know? There's, there's like, a, there's sometimes tend to have bugs, like, right here at the part where you have these... Those jumps right there. Though, that death effect, definitely really obnoxious and annoying and doesn't fit the level at all. And then... Even when it does show up, it's just really hideous. Like, I'm sorry, but you could see parts of the level still. Like, you could see the saw blades overlapping it, and it just really doesn't make the level look good with that death effect right there. That death effect needs work. Or just get rid of it in general. It doesn't... As long as one of those is changed, I'm, I, I really don't mind it, but... Yeah. So there's that. You go through here. This is easy. Then right here, this ship part I have a problem with because those pillars right there, the ones that you have to go in between, it's a chance at making it. Like the first one I got down, that one as you can see, it just shoots me down. That's the problem I hate with that pillar. That lag right there by the way is just me, it's just my software. But like, yeah, that pillar in general I really have a problem with. These pillars need to be changed because it just throws me off a lot. Like that, for example. Like, you really can't estimate how you're gonna move because those pillars just make the change for you. Like, my trick is to try to go up here and then hold it up, but it's a chance at doing that. That pillar really needs to be... Well, these pillars in general need to be changed or fixed. Because I really can't tolerate those. I keep forgetting to put checkpoints. But yeah, so I'm just gonna get back... Get through this part really quickly, and um, I'll go over the next segment oh my god I really hate that death effect for, with a passion and this ship part definitely with a passion because oh my god it's just great you know but yeah just go through here move through here okay 
I really hate this ship part. This ship part's gonna be the death of me. So just move through here. Okay. Woo! Like I said, this this level is just highly obnoxious. Like it's fun, it's enjoyable. I understand that. Like definitely fun. But the bugs just hold it back from that. The bugs really hold it back. This UFO, this ball part is really easy. That I don't understand. It's like I tap it, but it doesn't work occasionally. Okay. Okay. There. This part I have no problems with. It's really easy. There's nothing. Well, there's nothing wrong with it. This part. Ooh, this part. That part has a lot of bugs with timing. Like, it's ridiculous. As you, like, you could tell right there, for example. Not, not there. That was a bad example, actually. But earlier, like, the first attempt, you could tell that something was off. And as you could see, the death effect still glitches, and it's just horrible. Like, I'm not a level expert, but... I'm just, uh, I've played a lot of casual looking levels, a lot of easy demons and medium demons and such, so I kind of get some experience on how things look in there on. Like this level, decoration is nice, but uh, I do have to say for the beginning, the block design was confusing, and some of the background decoration does is lacking, it definitely is lacking. Especially with this color scheme a little bit, like with the orange fading to purple at easily. Yeah, right there is an example. One, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, four, okay. This UFO bothers me, bothers me, not that much, but just a little bit. Because you really have to set yourself up here. And that death effect really does bother, like, they sh there should be a toggle at least to turn that off, because... I prefer if that death effect wasn't there, in my opinion. Like I said, it just overlaps the levels level and just makes it look hideous. And there is definitely lack in background here. And this is obviously low detail, but still for LDM you should have a background. At least a solid good background there because this is just this feels a little empty. Transitioning into that is really frustrating. This video is basically going to be on this whole level right here. Okay, so you're going here. Okay. Like I said, this part probably one of the bothering ones. Like I know I spent quite a lot of time on this in practice, and I still can't get it down. Overall, like I said, this level's fun and all, but like, there's just a lot that holds back to it, which is bugs. This really plain, it needs work. Like, these areas right here are highly plain. That blue thing, that, that area right there where you have to tap the blue orb, the blue rings, definitely uh, can use a little fix. Because sometimes they kind of just launch you into the spike area. Okay, then right there is fine. This part is actually not bad. Like, this part, decoration-wise, it could use a little work. But gameplay-wise, I don't see no problem with it. Like, this part's actually not bugless. Like, nothing wrong with this part. And yeah, that's that part. Uh, you can see it was... Quite an interesting one, Temps 83. Overall though, my review, this level, I like it, but the thing is, I dislike it more than I like it mainly because of the prop the gameplay problems that occur while playing this. Uh, there definitely needs to be some fixes here, as you can see from the review that I was just giving out for this, but other than that, level is not not bad. I really don't just like I said, I like this level. I would give this a like, but I it's just too much bugs, dude. Like, I'm sorry, but I would say though that this is like a 7 star, 7 stars, and yeah overall this level though needs a little work, I'll, I'll gladly get back to it if it does get improved, 
But other than that, nothing much to say after that review. Alright guys, well the next um, level is Oh No by AL Fable Games Gaming. He did request three, but I think that's a little too much for one video, so I'm gonna do one. The first one he sent me, uh, Fable, if you're watching this, I just wanna let you know that that ID doesn't work. I don't know if he deleted the level or anything, but I put it in the thing and um, I couldn't find anything. Nothing came up. So until then, I'm gonna play the second one he requested, which is this one. Oh no, is the fat rat no no no, so let's get right into this one. I tried a little bit, I'm like, you know what, might as well just try it for like a few attempts. Like, I'll give it like 10, 5 attempts. And see where it goes from there on. Okay, this is gonna be an interesting level. Definitely gonna be interesting. Alright, I think I know where to go. Okay. Well, the song is definitely interesting. Considering it's no 90% of the time. And I'm just really bad at flying. So... I'm gonna go through this. It's medium. Also, I forgot to mention that this level is medium. Like, length. Oh, wow, alright. Should I give it 10? I'll give it 10. I'll give it 10 attempts and then I'll go into practice and then start. See what's going on. Overall, though, first off, my first impression. Uh, I don't know if it's like a preview or not, or like a work in progress, but definitely block design needs a little work. Or just decoration if you plan on keeping it like that simple. This part's pretty interesting, not gonna lie. Uh, it's, the level feels a little empty though, not gonna lie. It does feel a little empty. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Alright. Well, um... Uh, <laughs> I really didn't need practice mode for this, but I'm still gonna go in there to like kind of look at some level aspects here. So I'm gonna go back in there and see what's see what's going on. So I'm gonna put practice now to start off the block design. Like I said, uh, if you plan on keeping it simple, I then keep it that way. I just recommend adding a little more to the block design because it's a little too simple for a level. Unless it's a WIP, then my bad, but. Yeah, this block design needs a little work when um, when it comes to simplicity, if you plan on keeping it that way. Uh, background elements, uh, I get simple levels don't have that much background to it, but I definitely recommend you have some background here because it's a little too empty. Uh, I should really put checkpoints actually, hold on. I did not put a checkpoint, I'm an idiot. Alright, give me a second, I'm just gonna <laughs> go through this really quickly and try to put a checkpoint. Oh my god, why am I lagging so much? What is this? Computer, can you stop? Computer? Computer! Oh my god, why is it doing this? Be right back, I'm gonna restart the recording here. I'm gonna keep this footage, but I'm gonna restart. Okay, I'm back. Everything feels better. So, um, like I said, this area needs a little back- needs a background, for sure. Custom background or, yeah, whatever. It just needs a background because it's too plain in the back. I It feels empty. This level doesn't feel right. Uh, the no pops up an awful lot. Does, don't really mind it. This, it's confusing because it still remains gray in the background. The saw blades are clear. The saw blades are clear and everything. But the, the little structures that are there, they're all like colored. They're black with a color and it really kind of confuses me on what you're trying to do there. Uh, definitely recommend that you change that part up a bit, whether it's add some background elements or change the colors, because that color scheme just doesn't fit well. This part right here, quite empty in my opinion, that little don't jump area is not really necessary if you, if like the whole area right there is auto, uh, definitely get rid of that little pillar because it's really unnecessary, just add the invisible pads and rings or such as you did already. And, yeah, this part, alright, it's fine. That hole right there, though, that's definitely confusing. Because, as you could see, I, I didn't even, I wasn't even near it, and I couldn't get through it at all. So, go here. Oh, that was, that was stupid. Oh, I keep forgetting to put checkpoints. But, yeah, uh, that hole right there, I'm pretty sure you guys saw it yourself. I wasn't nearby it yet, and... 
it kind the level kind of just threw me off there. Okay, so there's like an invisible pad here. Fun fact, actually, um, if you go into the game files, the pads, the little things that like give you the jumps or gravity flips and such, they're actually called bumps. But yeah, this part right here, like I said, empty. And that don't jump pillar definitely doesn't need to be there. That hold right there is a little too, uh, too separate. I recommend that it should be a little more aligned with the icon. That way it doesn't fly off that easily. Uh, this, it's, it's adorable. I like this, uh, the, what do you call it? The wave section is pretty cute. I like the little faces on it. I, like I said, this whole level just needs a lot of decoration work, a lot of, Gameplay work like the gameplay. It's not that good. It's nothing special The gameplay definitely needs to be changed because it just feels bland this level It just feels bland like I like it, but it's bland, but you know what? I'll give you that like it's it's good. It's good this I could definitely say it's easy So I'm gonna give it like five stars overall though I'm just gonna leave a comment. I forgot to leave a comment on the last one. I'm gonna do that right now. Uh, but, uh, the level is interesting. Just needs more decoration. Also, don't judge me if I'm reading out loud. I'm just doing this so you guys can understand me or something. This is just needs more decoration, and like I said, I'm, I literally typed, and like I said, and basically just gameplay fixes because this feels too bland. More decoration and gameplay fixes, followed by what was the other one I said? Oh, gameplay fixes because the level feels bland. Did I just screenshot again? I did. Oh. Alright, well, that's that. Also, I'm going to comment this one too. I forgot to... Two switch cards. The level is definitely enjoyable though. But it does have too many bugs. Alright, there's that. And uh, moving on to the next request. Alright guys, and this is gonna be the last level I'm gonna review. I know I said I'd do like five in the level, uh, what do you call it, series and all that, but I planned on changing it up, because originally I planned on just playing the level, you know, just from there on, but I actually want to review it now. So I'm gonna do three levels per, per request uh, episode. So this is gonna be the last one. This is Dimensions by GDG123, Rockin' That Bass by Mr. Cool Tricks. It's harder, three coins, long, and it got quite a bit of ratings here. So like I said, I'm gonna go into this level, I'm gonna do some five attempts, five to ten attempts, and then I'll go into practice mode and review it. Okay, so first off, right off the bat, it gives a 1.9 style. I really like that, that's a pretty nice uh, nostalgic feeling there. Oh, inspired by Lemon, interesting. Uh, the background? Eh. It's alright. That could use a little more. I don't know, the background just feels weird to me. Gameplay could use a little work. It needs a little work, honestly, in my opinion. Okay! <laughs> well, I encountered my first bug. And I had no control over that. Like, I didn't press anything. I kind of just sat there waiting for me to drop or something. Right. But like I said, gameplay could use a little bit of work. Level seems pretty fun though. Uh, I like the color scheme. Well, pretty unusual, honestly. But... Magic singing. Hold on, let me just pause this really quickly. So first off, that drop right there with the auto, it had a bug there, so it definitely needs to be fixed there. The background decoration could use a little work. It's kind of kind of confusing. Kind of throws me off a little bit. The block design, little very basic. But if you're going for a 1.9 style, I understand. But just kind of add a little more to that element because it just lacks when it comes to 
custom block design and all that. Uh, the song, interesting choice. Gameplay works. Kind, it's it's kind of okay. It's it's okay. All right, this part's interesting. So I can say that this level's not really hard. I'd say it's like a normal or a hard difficulty. All right, that was all my fault. This is a temp score, so. Yeah, overall though, I really like this level. It's it's an interesting concept. Definitely, definitely worth playing. Although I think that's kind of it for this level. I'll, I'll see what's going on for the segment. I, I, if only I can get far at least. But I kind of gave my review for these parts. I wouldn't try to get that point on. Alright. And then this is where it drops, obviously. I found a point up there. Alright. Alright, so this wave part... Practice mode it is. Alright. So this level... It's pretty cool. I like it. Enjoyable in a way. Inspired by lemons. Uh... <clears throat> the block design needs a little work. I feel like there's a high abuse of saw blades. If I can make that jump. Oh my god! Okay. So the saw blades, I feel like they're abused in that part. Like, there's just too many. Uh, gameplay could use a little work. This ball part, really easy. This drop has a bug in it. So I'm gonna put a checkpoint there just to play it safe. And I did well, so... Just play this part. This part, pretty, pretty, pretty easy. Soothing. I would be the one to go for that coin, in all honesty. Now, now, uh, I'm just doing really bad, but don't expect too much out of me, guys, when it comes to these requests, because I will do bad, because, you know, doing commentary and playing at the same time is difficulty, like, I usually don't mess up this badly, but that's because I'm, like, focused a little bit, but here I'm kind of just trying to, like, think, multitask, while playing this level. Oh, nice. So yeah, this wave part, not bad, not bad. Uh, if I had the music, it'd definitely be interesting to see what's going on. Alright, now the transition coloring was a little weird. Uh, the Orbeus is, is pretty good, no bugs there. Oh my god, that was me. That was definitely me, I can admit that. Uh... Oh, we're doing something back on track right there. Okay, there's like back on track section where you have to jump over these bumps. Ooh, those are really tight jumps, but it's not that hard. Oh my god! Alright. <clears throat> Overall though, I really like this really like this level. It's uh it's a nice 1.9 or like uh Yeah, it's a really nice one point um early two not even early 2.0, like before 2.0 nostalgia vibe here. I like it a lot, it's really interesting. Surprise, uh, I really am surprised with the choice here. Color scheme could use a little work. Uh, background, like that for example right here, it's just uh, throws me off. Background could use work, gameplay definitely could use some work because it, uh, it's a little weird. Syncing, like with the rhythm and all that could use work too. Uh, but other than that, this level's good. I, I can't talk. This level's good. And difficulty, I'm gonna give that like... Four to five. I'm going to say four. Four stars. And uh, with that, I'll say... Background elements and coloring. No, not coloring and block design. I'm just gonna say background coloring block 
Because I'm not going to fit. Lock this on. Alright. So there's that, and I think that concludes this part of this video, guys. Well, that concludes this video, guys. If you want more of this, like I said, uh, just comment saying that you want more. And if you guys do want your levels being shown in the next episode, I will gladly take it. Just leave your ID in the next um, in the comment section below. Or you could always just m message me, like I said, in the announcement video anywhere based off the medias that I gave you, like Discord, Twitter, Geometrash itself. But I really hope you guys like that series. I look forward to doing it more, and I definitely plan on making it much more better than the first episode. Trust me, I have a lot planned for it. So, with that being said, I will see you all in the next video, guys. Oh, 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 o